Hi everyone, I hope you've been well. Um, Grace here. I just received the second package from Lisa Goss, and I don't know if you guys remember, but when she sent in her entry for my Christmas craft challenge last weekend, um, she had let me know that she forgot to include some stuff and that she was going to send it in a separate package, and I was like, oh, that's so sweet. You didn't have to, but thank you. And so the package arrived, and oh my gosh, you guys, um, wow, beautifully packaged, and here, let me show you, and you guys will see what I mean. At first, when I opened the package, I thought that she had just purchased these from somewhere, and like, you know, at a craft store and was sending these to me. Do you guys see this? Let me see if I can get it closer. So what she's done is die cut various sizes of these flowers, glued them together, and then she centered them with these tiny little um, pearl flat bags and these little um, crystal flat bags. And then imagine my shock, like here you can't really tell, right, that they are handmade by her. But then let me make sure that I, and this is such a great way of making sure that your um, embellishments don't get ruined. And then this one she said for you, and, and then take a look. Can you guys see this? Just flabbergasted. And then there's how they stick. Oh, you can't see it. They definitely have dimension to them. And I was like, oh, these are really pretty. And then I see here, made by, and then her name. So these are all handmade embellishments, but she's put them in these packaging so that it looks as though they're store-bought. Just beautiful. And then she gave me more flowers. Oh my goodness. Lisa, thank you so much. You so This is totally above and beyond. Oh, there's no stamp here, but this is certainly above and beyond what you you know, needed to do what you should have done, but I will nevertheless enjoy um, and treasure them. Thank you so much. So there are these, right? And they're so beautifully done. And then she included this big, huge jumbo paper clip, which you guys know I'm always using paper clips. And then she included a little sample of some deco tape. Isn't that cute? Well, these are so cute. Thank you, Lisa. And then what I thought was super, super fun, you guys, she had a little um, pack of notes stuck on here, and I was like, what is this stuck on to? And then look, gems from Mother Goose. It's a little journaling card. How cute. You guys know I like this vintage style, right? How adorable. And then it's um, brown on the back. And then this one, again, oh, so adorable. Pink on the back. Lisa, these are so cute. Thank you. Ah, oh, the two little pigs. And then, I actually can't tell who this is. But it just says moments. It's a little girl, and I think she's trying to peek. I can't tell who she is from the fairy tales. And then it says, tell me a story. Oh, this is so pretty. Thank you so much. Um, I'm out of camera um, view here a little bit, huh? All right, here you go, guys. You can see this better. Thank you so much, Lisa. I'm going to link down in the description bar, everyone, Lisa's channel. Um, I believe Lisa's the one who d has an Etsy shop, too. So anyway, I will link down in the description bar her channel and then also the link to her first entry. I mean, her entry, the first video that I filmed last weekend. So all right. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Thank you so much, Lisa.